Welcome back to another jQuery tutorial. In this jQuery tutorial, I'm going to introduce you guys to the newly, newly released jQuery user interface 1.8. Um, this was released, I believe, um, about a week ago. And the cool thing about jQuery user interface is that it provides you with a huge array of these great user interface tools that are so easy to implement into your website. There are some basic things that you have to understand about jQuery, which we sort of went over a little bit in the first two tutorials. But the best way to learn something is to actually get down and just start doing it. And sometimes people can talk about it and people can show you how to do it but you really can't learn until you do it yourself so I'm sort of gonna introduce you to jQuery user interface I'm gonna show you how to download it I'm gonna show you how to create your own themes and then I'm gonna sorta of let you dive in and sorta of discover it for yourself so I'm just gonna point you in the right direction and after I show you how to download it and I show you um, what it's all about, I'm going to go through and detail um, all the custom components that are inside jQuery user interface. So to get started, I went to jQuery.com and up here at the top you see um, a link to jQuery UI. So go ahead and click on that. And there's some stuff you can read here about jQuery UI. There's uh, a lot of stuff you can read here, actually. But um, right now, I'm going to show you what jQuery UI has to offer. Um, I'm going to show you to uh, the demos and documentation link right here. Um, you see there's interactions, widgets, and effects and you can see there's these draggable, droppable, there's just a lot of different options of things you can do and I'm not going to run you through all of them right now but I am going to say that they're really cool so go ahead and click on themes as well and I'm going to click on gallery right here and now you can see what's what some of these these I'm going to call them widgets um, what they look like and you can see things like accordion and tabs and if you remember in the earlier uh, Dreamweaver CS4 tutorials we were going over Adobe's version of uh, of spry assets and a lot of the stuff they had looks similar to this but this is a much more updated cleaner quicker faster version well it isn't a version of Adobe spry but it has a lot of the same things in it and it also has some new things that are completely different and I think better and cleaner and much more documented than the Adobe Spry stuff but anyway as you can see over here to the left we have all these different themes and you can click on them and you can see that as soon as you click on them it's gonna change the colors and the theme of these individual pieces of the jQuery user interface and what's cool about jQuery UI is that all of these pre-configured themes are ready for you to download right now. It's, it's as easy as finding which one you want and when you go to the download page which I'm about to show you all you have to do is select it from a drop down menu and then you extract it, you extract the zip folder into your web page and voila it's right there for you. So now that I've introduced you to the gallery, to the themes, I'm going to let you explore them. I'm going to let you check them out. Um, there are a lot to view, and you can also create your own. You can, I mean, there is a ton of options here, and I'll let you run through those. And uh, we will go through, go through these later uh, in more detail. But as you can see, I mean, you just have complete customization over how you want your your widgets to look. So let's get to it. Let's go ahead and download. Um, let's go ahead and download these 
these pieces of, uh, of jQuery UI. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to go with the, the UI lightness theme. So up here at the top, I'm going to click on download. And as you can see, it pops up with some options here. Like there's all these different components and they're all selected. And basically, all these different components are individual pieces of the jQuery UI that you can select yourself, you can select all of them, you can select a few of them, I guess it really depends on what you need. But since we're going to go through and we're going to check out each one of these components individually in this jQuery series, I'm going to go ahead and download each and every one of them. And that is what the default is um, for when you click on the download. All of them are selected, you can see that here, 30 of 30 selected. So over here to our right, this is the drop down menu I was talking about. You see all these different themes that were created for us already. And I'm just going to go ahead and stick to the one that they have as the default, which is UI lightness. And there are some advanced theme settings here. But we're not going to worry about right, that right now. Um, we're going to download version 1.8 because that is the newest version. And you see that um, it is for jQuery 1.8. Point four plus, and in the past tutorials, um, the jQuery version we downloaded was 1.4.2, so we're good to go. So I'm going to click on download, and I'm going to save this, and you can see that it has completed the download. I'm going to double click on that, and I'm going to select all of the components inside of this folder. I'm going to copy them and then I'm going to go to my local host. I'm going to go to the WAMP folder which that is where um, my local host is inside the www root. And you can see I've already created this jQuery UI folder. And so inside the jQuery UI folder is where I'm going to paste all the stuff that I just copied. And this might take a second. You can see that it's 3.27 meg, which is considerably large, but with with all the components that we get, it's uh, it's not that bad. No. All right, perfect. So since this is just an introduction to jQuery UI, I'm going to go ahead and, and have a look at what this page looks like. And you can see it looks sort of similar to the stuff that we are inspecting on the themes you can see these these widgets and these pieces not all of them but some of them are on the example page that comes with the download and um, you can see how the theme that we created is displayed and so now that you have been exposed to jQuery UI I have a feeling that you're you know you're seeing this stuff and you're like wow you know I didn't even realize all this stuff was out there for free for me to go download and for me to check out and use for free. So that's that's the beauty of open source software. That is that is why I'm an advocate of open source software and why I really love companies that choose to allow people to come and develop and use their stuff for free because it's a great product. So that wraps up this tutorial. Um, in the following tutorials we're going to go ahead and check out all of these different components and we're going to look a little bit deeper into creating our own theme and hopefully you guys are excited and pointing around and looking at all these things being like wow I, I really didn't notice that I could do all this and in the next tutorials we're really going to dive into jQuery UI and at the same time we're going to learn jQuery we're going to learn how to manipulate all these different things and how to use them on a on a day-to-day -day basis so I will see you guys in the next tutorial